Let's solve the following equation. 81 power sine square x plus 81 power cosine square x equal to 30. First, instead of cosine square x, we will put one minus sine square x. Then 81 power sine square x plus here we will distribute the powers over 81 to get 81 power one times 81 power minus sine square x equal to 30. Then we will multiply the whole equation by 81 power sine square x to get the following form. The equation becomes 81 power sine square x all square minus 30 times 81 power sine square x plus here we have 81 and 81 same base so we will add up the powers so we will get 81 power sine square x minus sine square x 81 power 0 which is 1 so we will have here 81 and equals to 0 then let u equal 81 power sine square x here is u so we will get u square minus 30 u plus 81 equals to 0 then we get the following quadratic equation u square minus 30 u plus 81 equals to 0 the discriminant of the following quadratic equation is delta equal b square minus 4ac which is minus 30 square minus 4 times 1 times 81 it will be 576 which is 24 square the two roots u1 and u2 are minus b minus radical delta over 2a which is 3 and u2 the, sec the second root minus b plus radical delta over 2a which is 27 we will discuss the values of the two roots u1 and u2 first for u equal u1 81 power sine square x u equals to u1 3 but 81 is 3 power 4 so we get 3 power 4 power sine square x equal 3 power 1. Here we multiply the two powers to get 3 power 4 sine square x equal 3 power 1. Same base, so the powers are equal. Then we have 4 sine square x equal to 1. Then sine square x equal to 1 over 4. So sine x equal to plus minus radical 1 over 4, which are half and minus half but we know that half is sine of pi over six and minus half is sine of minus pi over six so we will have the two equations note that if sine x equals sine alpha then the solutions are x equal alpha plus two k pi or x equal pi minus alpha plus two k pi where k is an integer for the first equation if sine x equals sine pi over 6, then x will be pi over 6 plus 2k pi or pi minus pi over 6, which is 5 pi over 6 plus 2k pi. For the second equation, we have x equal minus pi over 6 plus 2k pi and pi minus minus pi over 6, which is pi plus pi over 6 equals to 7 pi over 6 plus 2k pi. For u equals to u2, we have 81 power sine square x, which is 3 power 4 sine square x equals to 27, which is 3 power 3. The same, we have same base, so the powers are equal. Then 4 sine square x equals to 3, sine square x equals to 3 over 4, so sine x will be plus or minus radical 3 over 2. But sine pi over 3 is radical 3 over 2, and sine minus pi over 3 is minus radical 3 over 2. We do the same. If sine x equals sine pi over 3, then x will be pi over 3 plus 2 k pi, or pi minus pi over 3, which is 2 pi over 3 plus 2 k pi. For the second equation, if sine x equals to sine of minus pi over 3, then x will be minus pi over 3 or pi minus pi over 3, which is a plus pi plus pi over 3 equals to 4 pi over 3 plus 2 k pi. So these are the solutions of the given equations. Pi over 6, 
5 pi over 6 minus pi over 6, 7 pi over 6, pi over 3, 2 pi over 3, minus pi over 3, 4 pi over 3, all plus 2 k pi, where k belongs to them.